but it doesn't work at all now. on super duty what's super duty i'm not getting a super duty hi hello hello um today has been quite a day um i was gonna shoot a video on how to change an airbag because i gotta change an airbag and it has been downhill from there <laughs> so perfect timing a few minutes to chill good i don't have a super bunch of time just because um my handle's Lisa. I know, it's real challenging. Um, happy birthday, brother. Um, so I was going to change an airbag and make a video out of it. So I picked up the airbags yesterday. Well, got them dropped off. I picked them up out of, the, out of my workplace and brought them. So I got one extra one in the truck and one here. So uh, we're kind of looking around to where we're going to put the train horns underneath. And Fucking nailed it. What? Injector O-rings. They're burnt. They're crisp right off. Oh, really? Yeah. That's cool. And then, um... Buckle up. So you went underneath the truck and found a leak here and a leak there. And I don't think that's supposed to do that. And wow, your shocks are blown. And oh, this thing fell off and wiggled the little AC thing till it exploded and shot free on everywhere. It looked like alien goo. Time to put her back behind fence and what, boys and girls? What? Back in the penalty box. Slow her down a little. Oh, penalty box? Ain't no penalty box. Most of the time I'm either trying to catch up or get away. Get away? <laughs> uh, oh, is it St. Patty's Day? Oops, I'm not wearing green. Yes, I am. I'm wearing green. This is green, right? Is this green? Are you wearing green? Eh! Ow! My undies are green. No, they're not. You are only allowed to pinch once. Where's your green? You're so lucky. Yeah. <laughs> so I owe you one. <laughs> Thanks for telling us it's St. Patty's Day. Jeez. I know. I know it's on his hat. I wasn't saying that. I wanted to pinch him. Would you drive in a straight line? Yes, ma'am. So I went to the grocery store to get something because Caleb's fuel is black. And it had something to do with, what was it? The rocker broke when we hauled it home. Yeah, and I ran it and it smoked the injector O-rings. Oh, I wanted to tell Jerry she probably... Ran it and smoked the injector O-rings. So he's over here trying to fix it. So we're trying to put this airbag on and make the video. But meanwhile, we got to fix the, the AC... No, Michael. We're trying to fix the AC thing. So he's going in and getting a bolt. And then he's got to get something else. The O-rings or something. I don't know. All I know is it's taking a really long time to, to get anything done. Happy birthday, Benjamin. Gonna stay home. Oh, my neck. Yeesh. At least I'm not being electrocuted in my ears this time. So, I was gonna show you everything we were doing right up into the airbag and then just record that and edit it for later, but, um, we're just, I guess we, like, so there's a, oh, I could show you what I fixed yesterday. So there's this boot that came off and I could show you how I fixed how I fixed it yesterday, but he's like, it isn't on all the way, and it's not tight, and it's not this, so it's like, well, it was cold, and, you know, I was figuring this out myself. Yeah, well, I asked him about installing the air horns, and we were going to, but we found too much other stuff wrong, and so now it's going to have to wait until we get back. Changing airbags is no fun? I don't know. We'll see. I guess I'm going to learn and find out, because I'm going to make a video acting like I know what I'm doing, when I'm really, what's going to happen is I'm going to, he's going to give me the rundown. He's got all the right tools and sizes. So I'm going to kind of run through the tool list or whatever. Ooh, it's hot in here. And then I'm going to start trying to do it myself. And when I get stuck, I'm going to be like, can you help me? So I've laid the law down finally. I'm like, stop fixing my truck for me. I want to fix my truck. So win the load count? I don't know. You're going to have to look back and see. Let me know. I know. I know. It's 40 below. Yes. The truck have Arctic installation? Probably. Oh, I need to get another torch. Ooh, there might be one in here. Let me go look. If 
there's a torch in here, I need one because I do need another one. Thanks. All they have is large and extra large gloves. Do they have medium? I gotta wash the laundry. On camera. <laughs> well, it just means it's because the power went right. Yeah. Does it really? Yeah. Okay. So that's not really like your fault. Uh, it's not like really your fault, is it? No, what? Your fault? No, but it's, it means the motor comes back no. apart. Container seedling torch. You gotta go. No, we're we're going where they got torches. Oh, you are. That ain't here though. And gloves. Yep. Okay, cool. Remind me, rubber gloves and a torch. They will. So I was just coming to see that. Yeah. Wash cylinder. So does that mean you're not running today? I don't know what it means. You want a team so I can get there and back and get home? Right. You want to put trained horns on instead? I don't know. You're all over the place, you little stinker. I am all over the place. Your bottom view is great. How about talking? Mm -hmm. Like they do in the Insta. But I got my onesie on my onesie <laughs> all right thanks for the reminder on the torch yes i'm using the torch to put the rubber thing on i just remember that i think that's getting really low so i was just going to get a new one because i think i have more tanks that you can oxy acetylene torch well i don't want to burn the truck down roku huh that's good i know that's what well you guys will be an expert too because i'm oh i forgot to buy the water <laughs> You guys will be an expert too because everything I'm learning, I'm teaching you. I've been kind of running on high lately, um, kind of like stressed high. It was a really good day. Oh, I didn't even tell you all the updates. So it was a really good day yesterday, had good talks and drove around, did awesome stuff. Then get into phone service and my tenant's calling me and she's like, um, your horse Ember ripped her eyelid off. It's like, she what? So she caught it on something like this and pulled this around off and ripped it so like her eyelashes are like hanging and so she's calling the vet at like after hours of course because they ever can't ever hurt themselves when it's you know cheap and the vet was like yes we can see her bring her in right now and they were about so she called to get approval rear airbag yes it's a rear airbag um called to get approval to make sure she could take her in and i'm like definitely take her in and she's like, well, I guess we'll just hook up to your bumper pull. So I have a bumper pull trailer and a couple um, goosenecks. The but they don't, I think they sold their pickup to afford rent. <laughs> so they, uh, all they had was the bumper pull, which is rusty and falling apart. So they're like, I guess we'll just put her in the bumper pull. And I guess they're not doing barn calls, which is crazy to me. And, um. Then the vet, then the vet's like, oh, I got pictures. It's fine. We'll do it tomorrow. And I thought there was like a time limit before, like after, like something ripped apart or something that you got to put it back together before it starts healing. And so I'm like, well, I don't really want her eyelid to rot and fall off and she lose her eye completely. That's bright. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm good. I'm just bumped out. It's like, it's always something, isn't it? Yeah. And it's not going to be covered. No. No. It's pretty normal to wash a cylinder when you break the rock. Oh. I should have put I should have put new rockers on it. Fuck it. Your your airbag's pretty the airbag you're pretty no leave it complex com, com, collapsed. It'll be easier. How about I just take it from the guy who's gonna teach me how to do this? Well, Lisa. Yeah, it's gotta be cool. <laughs> oh good you got uh the job at carlisle that's cool yeah i hope ember's okay too so yeah i had to take it off the truck one so she they're like no if you just put a lot of like eye not drops but like lube or something in there then it's supposed to keep it good and like if she starts rubbing it and starts like ripping her eyelid off, then she's like just cross tire so she can't rub. Well, I have, cause I'm a dork, you know those race horses, they have those masks that go over their face with like the cups. I have some of those and I'm like, why don't you just put that on her head with the little 
so she can't rub her, her eye on anything. I still have my what? My pitter? Um, so they found a truck. I was desperately looking for a pickup truck because she wasn't going to have a truck the next day because dude man and her husband um, are working and he has the pickup. So I don't know what they worked out, but I was calling around. I'm like, I need someone to take my horse into the vet, be there at 10 a.m. to get her eyeball sewn back on or her eyelid, eyelashes. I don't know what they are. Anyway, parts of her body. And I'd show you a picture, but it's pretty gross. Like I was my stomach is so upset and then I'm like trying to look at the picture and I'm like <laughs> my poor baby why oh Peterbilt yeah and that thing's not going to be around much longer if it keeps up this stuff I've made one trip without issues one one trip and now the shock's blown and this is leaking and that's leaking and this ain't right and airbags done and I fixed the boot and it's, it's like every single trip something's wrong He's like, you need to slow down. I'm like, I don't think I'm going that fast. Like, I'm literally just trying to keep up to him. I need water. Anyway, so she's at the vet. She found a truck. She's at the vet right now. And they go back and pick her up. And hopefully she'll be all stitched back together. I want pictures. So that stressed me out and started the whole thing. And then it was like trying to get the airbag here and... Really? Ember? That's funny. Trucks are super high maintenance. I can't even believe how much I spend on stupid truck stuff. I'd be rich if I could have what the truck makes me but not put anything back into it, which I guess isn't fair, but just this pickup hasn't been like that. Yeah, I just put two grand in the pickup because my tire was about to fall off and it needed all new like ball bearings and joints and all that junk. So I ripped through money pretty good. Then we went to the store to go get a bunch of stuff and we were trying to get to Walmart before it closed. Then our credit cards wouldn't work at Walmart. It's under warranty, that's good. It's just, it's always something, you're right. It's always something. Pop the hood open, try to put train horns on and find 10 other things that I need to fix before I can even go trucking a day. Now his truck's cylinders washed out. He just got it rebuilt. Yeah, there's never any extra money, it's true. So I was gonna have like, I thought it would be fun to do a live while we put train horns on, but that's not happening now what they do I know so more than more than anything I'm just like worried about my little horse because it's my horse I mean they're all my horses but that's my horse it's like you don't make yourself not rideable that means and I can't ride Sky until she gets a chiropractic appointment because her back's sore so that's the only horse left is Inky Stinky Stinky Inky Caleb's horse but my other two are going off for training and so I'll go home and do the ferry apartment then I come back and do three more trips and then I'm gonna go back home again and get them ready to go to training so I have eight horses now since happy was born and then Jericho my tenants horse is still there um, which I never thought to ask I could ride her I don't know why I couldn't wear her yeah got the mini yep he ain't going anywhere yes life's curveballs it's been a interesting day I mean I went to the grocery store and came back and I'm like I already have a story that would take me as long to tell you as when I was there of what happened at the grocery store. <laughs> like I went there for like these peanut butter like granola to put in my parfaits that I make because I forgot it yesterday of course when I went to the store and I went back and of course the only thing they didn't have at the store was the peanut butter stuff so I ended up buying a bunch of other stuff. Then I get to the, to the checkout counter and this lady she's like working there she runs back she's like oh my goodness oh my goodness like all panicked. Yeah. That's true. She's running around. She's like, I'm like, are you okay? And she's like, oh, right, Rocky. <laughs> I only have one truck. I don't need any more than that. My pickup and my semi. A street bike, a dirt bike, a mini bike. Eight flipping horses. That's more than I can keep up with. Anyway, so she's running around. I'm like, are you okay? And she's like, I need to help. She's a little Asian lady. I need to help guy over there. But then I, my customers need me here, but I need it there too. She's like, come over here. <laughs> yeah, one more trip. Or maybe if we can get everything friggin' fixed. I don't know if it, Caleb's going to go with a cylinder washed out. And uh, I'm going to try to, but I, gotta, but I discovered, okay. So I told you guys yesterday in that last live that found those two air leaks going on underneath the bullet. 
Um, I'm not planning on getting any more horses. I plan on getting more born, but I keep planning on selling them. I had never planned on selling this first one anyway. If it, if it was a boy, I might, and if it was a girl, I wasn't gonna, and it's a girl, happy, so I wasn't planning on doing anything with her, but um, Caleb wants a gypsum, so a Frisian gypsy cross, and he wants to keep it, but I'm like, we, we can you wait to breed that one later because we don't have any room right now. Well, the mini's a half horse, and then the other half would be happy, right? Because she's a baby, so it'd be like eight horses total. No. Yeah, seven horses. I have no idea. Um, hi, Finland. Anyway, asked that lady if she was okay, and she's trying to help me because a stupid tiny little UPC wouldn't scan, so she's trying to type in the numbers and she can't see it. She's like, I gotta go get my phone so I can see it. So she takes a picture of it and she's trying to like blow it up and it's all blurry and her screen's all flipping every which way. And I'm like, okay, I'll try to help her. My zebra, I don't have a zebra. I mean, I'm a zebra, but. And so I take a picture and I open it up. I'm like, okay, I can read it. So I start punching in. She's like, you can read it? I'm like, yes. She's like, oh, thank goodness. <laughs> and I was just like, it's okay, calm down. We got this. And then she's like, I gave you $2 off paper plates for being patient. I'm like, it's cool, okay half a day riding yeah the mini horse is might be my good riding horse here in a minute and a half if I got if I, can, I don't know if I can ride Ember or not I mean I don't want to stress her out was she on stall rest because of an eyeball no I didn't have a zebra there was a Photoshop we did with me on a zebra but if you look really close I've got like two heads no the tenants didn't sell Jericho they sold Cody they're still working on selling Jericho but she hasn't sold yet and I was just like, Caleb's like, you shouldn't ride her. She's old and can't see. And I'm like, she's fine. A little horse, huh? So I was like, well, maybe she'll let me ride her because I never thought of riding Jericho, but they, they don't ride really. I mean, I'm just so thankful that they caught Ember's eyeball and Happy's shoe and all oh, the vet bills are getting as retarded as the mechanic bills. I have like a thousand stories. There's another story I had going on earlier too. What was it? Hi, James. Why won't I have any more problems? Oh, my day will be fine. I'm just, I feel like I got a lot to do. Like an airbag might not be a big deal to him, but to me, I'm like, okay, let me get ready. Oh, do I have the Ice Road Truck DVD sets? I have, no, I do not. Um, I got some from England and they do not play in American DVD players. So I can only watch it on the computer. Oh, names of the horses. Okay, Sky Rocky and Ember are my core three. The two Tennessee Walkers and the Mini. And then I got, well, he's got Ink, the Baroque Pinofrisian. I got Alaska, the Baroque Pinofrisian. And I got Seven and maybe my two gypsies and the baby happy so ink alaska sky rocky ember seven maybe happy so yeah eight <laughs> you're leaving again already yeah i'll i'll film the airbags and post it later on my youtube and stuff because i want to get in different camera angles and you know make it look nice instead of trying to do this i do not like hot food i think pepper is hot So we're gonna run around doing errands. I'm not sure what he's doing in there now. I'm about ready to go get that water. Uh, they weren't really cheap. They were like five, six hundred dollars. Breaking a horse to ride. Can I explain that? Not sitting here, no. I don't even know the process of breaking. I send him to someone else to do the basics so that. All right, Ben, see you later. I'll keep smiling, I'm just, woo. <laughs> like got a lot to do in a very short time and don't know if I'm gonna get out of here today I just got the text from the the um, dispatcher going your loads ready Lisa I'm like cool <laughs> not much I can do about it no I know five or six hundred isn't cheap my favorite color I don't know I really like lime green because it's Kawasaki color but like I really like blacks whites and grays 
They're just, I don't know, classy and easy and match everything, I guess. My truck's black. I said my truck's gray. All my horses are black and white. What's up, Rocky? Wow. Yeah, but what pound are the bags? Because I'm pretty sure I got a heavier duty of airbags. I got the new way suspension on there. And it's a four bag. Netflix shows. Um, yeah, The Chosen. I'm still on that one. I haven't watched anything since. 46,000? Oh, okay. Huh. I don't know. Don't know why we get all the bad prices. I have a limit to everything. Have you seen the... There's some guy on, I don't know if it's TikTok or what it is. Caleb watches this guy, but he, uh, he just eats peppers. Just, I don't know. Yes, the injector. Uh, so he lost that rocker and it made the injector go bad, which was some seals of something getting oil in the fuel. So I guess it washed the cylinder. I'm not sure what made it. Probably, probably the rocker breaking. Davey? Four bags? Poked? No, um, just the one. I can't even show you guys. Well, I will. I'll show you. I'll show that. I'll show the and on the video. Yeah. On the video where I found the hole. All right, here come. Here he comes again. Maybe we'll go somewhere. Look for something. Uh, are we gonna survive today? Yeah, we are. You? We are. Yeah. Are just no, it's, it's not gonna be. I mean, it's just one of those days. It's not gonna be a quick day. No, I'm, oh. I'm almost wondering if we should even go to work. Well, I need to be home Monday, so if we don't go to work, we can put the train horns on and just get everything around. all fixed up, and still not take it to Kenworth on Monday, and then go home. I'll go home early and it's go see Happy. Like... Yeah, I know. I don't know. It's it's hard to want to go when we haven't even got anything done yet. Wash, wash, like can't drive it, home. Huh? Mm -hmm. I just got a message from dispatch going, your load's ready. I was like, oh, back. oh good. No, I didn't even text back. I'm just like, I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Because they're saying that my air compressor's in. Then they're like, oh wait, never mind, it's not in, it never shipped. Then they're like, okay, it's in. Set up an appointment for Monday, bring it in. Okay, well, I gotta be home Monday, so I gotta bring it in on the weekend. Sunday, which they're closed, so I had to coordinate that whole deal. But that means I need a ride, so Caleb's got to be around when I need to ride back, or I'm walking, and that's no fun in 20 below or whatever it is. And then they just called and they're like, Oh, our bad, it's not here. It's like, so Don't bring it in Monday. She's like, Well, yeah, I mean, you can keep running, um, you can keep running the truck if you need to. And it's like, Well, it'll be my 34 then. She's like, Oh rather be down one day than like three or four and at this point I'm like just do the three or four so I can go home play with my happy make more of the mineral baggy things since I got more of those in since that's such a blast we got time to make a trip we'll just have to be on the night schedule it's up to you should I go back to bed <laughs> Torching your gloves. Torching glove time, people. Oh, I don't have my money though. Come on. Because I left it with the other one. No, I didn't get the train horns installed. That's what we were trying to do when I discovered all the loops. Yeah, I, I didn't bring it because it's a different home case. I love here. They're the best. All right. stuff's the best. Mm. 
Holy socket, look at that. That's huge. <laughs> I don't think that's what I'm looking for, though. What am I looking for? Oh, yeah, torch. But these are so cool. Look at that. It's huge. Anchorage, Alaska, Miami. No, it's freaking bright out. We live in Alaska. We don't know what the sun is. Okay. Here's a stupid torch. Where's the torches at? Uh, over there, I think. Oh. What about the rubber glove? On the tea handle. Okay. Yeah, I love these things. They're just like the best. It's a tea handle song. Ooh, these are good too. Pry bars. And getting brakes loose on ice sticks. Or drop, drop flats. Or... Yeah. All right, he said over here, so let's look over here. Now I got about three inches. Ooh, I need gloves too. And then they get, and then both catch at the same time. Yeah. I actually forgot I needed some more gloves. I got a hole in them. Mm, I like these ones, but they're always too big. Don't they make smaller ones? Extra large, large, medium, maybe medium. Let's see here. Still way too big. Don't they have like a small? Hey, ladies aren't in the industry, so we don't sell gloves small enough for ladies' hands. But I like these insulated ones. <sighs> that sucks. I don't see anything else. But I'm gonna take them because I need them. My hands are getting cold in my other ones. Okay, torches. Well, not kind of that, that kind of torch. Don't want that. Please. Oh, there we go. How much is this stuff? I do need water. Um, well, it would be nice if there was a price on it. Is this the right thing? Propane? They're right here, but I don't know which ones I need. Yeah, but I don't know which one I need. I mean, I have some tanks, but like the other things lose some. What do you mean? What, what do I need? What are you looking this, for? This, this. I don't know what you got that you, what doesn't work? It, nothing, it's just empty. Oh, then you just need one of these. Oh, that other thing, but the, the, the top is like loose, is that okay? We could try to tighten it up, and if not, you know where this place is at, and you can get one of these. One of those? Okay. Then so, do they, let's uh, go. Do they have rubber gloves? I don't know. Okay. Because so I got yeah, these. Down there on the left. Down here on the left. Oh, okay. Extra large, large, medium. I think these are better ones. These ones? All right. Yep. All right. What size do you want? Medium. All right. Thank you. I got uh, a medium. Water uh, yeah, let's do two. Well, I just feel bad because it's like, I'm, I don't have my money, but I'll be that. Yeah. Well, I know. Thank you. Okay, I'm not just now. I'm going to credit. So, you want me to just make sure it's all done? Yes, because I did, I did line detail and everything, but yes. Check. So, we did return those people to return the log. Yep, I saw that. Yep. You're all good. You did a great. Hold on. Hold on. The only thing, you didn't give them a line price on that. You got to edit the pricing on this film. Or else we are going to return it for $0. Yeah, a little bit more money back. Yeah. That price because we just sold it to him today. If that date doesn't match the sale date, we can talk again. For these two, that he returned? Hi. Oh, you Can we get these for free? Can we get these for free? Do they give us these glasses at work? Do they give us these glasses at work? I don't know. Am I anywhere? No, no. Right. Oh.
Yep. But that date is like from you 2021. Don't use this. Oh. So Mine are all scratched. What color do you want? Yep. Well, well, yeah, no, you're good. So then, for card, we're gonna enter oh, no, all the way at the end. Yeah. How do I go to? Do I enter it myself. Oh, cash card or cash? Oh, you haven't done that yet. Oh, so yes. Alaska yeah. West. Escape. Oh, escaping. Yeah. Not an escape. Escape. Okay, credit card number. Four three four two. I don't know what they're calling. Alaska West Express. Zero seven nine four. Two zero nine nine. You're probably come up with a number. I don't care how it's done, I just want to pay for it and leave. That's right. So, so you're you name, I can do the discount. I'll Caleb Benson. Caleb. Phone number? 907 5235. Okay. Who knows? Oh, hold it. Mmm, Seattle. Aren't those flowers so pretty? Mm hmm. Yeah. I love them. I just got them yesterday. Oh, these ones? Yeah, yep. Oh, they're real. They are real, yeah. Funny. My my uh, one horse, her name's Seven, and her color's yellow, but I don't like yellow, so I'm like, her color is sunflower. Oh, yeah, and it comes so, in this cute little pot, so, too. Isn't that so sweet? Yeah. I get one for every holiday. I got a Thanksgiving one. You mean one. for, like, this? Yeah, yep, yeah, the whole bouquet, everything. It comes with a little shamrock and stuff. Yeah. For Thanksgiving, I got one that was in a wicker basket that looked like a turkey. Oh, really? So it's that's like, funny. instead of it having its big, full tail, it had the flowers. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's super they're cool. so fun. And we got a big turkey balloon. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, it's, it, I like being festive. Oh, right on. <laughs> 62. All right. You want to frisk me for it? Sure. Frisk you. Can I sign one? Do you need me to sign one? Yes, please. Ah, <laughs> uh, sure. It's a charms, too. Yeah, sure, I'll take a bag. We're so indecisive, I don't know how we get anything done. I'm going to stop asking questions and do it. Oh, okay. What female color? Job My job, too. And I'm yeah, a part female. He's decisive than I am. See you later. Thank you. All right, we're out. Thank you. I cannot get in and out of my truck when I have oversized coveralls and snow pants. Well, thank you. Where's that receipt me? I hear it. I'm keeping it because it's right off. You're keeping it, but I still got to pay you? Yeah. <laughs> Do you want it? I don't Whoa. think you can write it off. I'll have to give you a receipt if you want to write it off. But you can't write it off using my card. No, I can't? No. Okay. But I, you could write it off. I can give you a receipt. Um, well, whatever. $62 ain't going to save the world. It isn't? No. Nope. I've been turning in $4 Clear. receipts. Yeah. Clear. Hi, you. Where are we going now? Find a bolt for that stupid fucking AC line. I was still line. looking for the bolt, huh? Or that stupid mess in the AC line. Is there going to be water in here? Because I'm thirsty. You are. Yeah, and I kept meaning to buy it at the store and I kept forgetting. You got 97 gallons. Yeah, the at the shop, but I'm thirsty now. Oh, fast on. The Alaska Axe Company, that's so much fun. You go in there and throw axes at things. I'm ready to throw some stuff around. I thought you were in a good mood. I am, I'm just <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if that, I don't know if that means he can't. Uh. Let's just say the hard part that he was given to that girl is how he treats everyone. And I don't really like it. And that's why we are not together. Because I don't like that. He says he's working on it, but like some of that stuff just is frustrating. So I get it. 
You got kicked out of what? Yeah, anyway. I don't like it either, and I don't think talking to people like that helps anything, and I know he's frustrated because I get what he's saying. Some people are just like, there was one lady, oh, the, where I was getting the hay, and she was just like, so I just got into my computer, and it says this, and I'm like, I don't care about the details, I want to buy hay. Like, she was like, I'm like, do you have Timothy squares? And she's like, uh, let me look, I'll check in my computer, and then she does, and then, um, she's like, uh, Yes, we do, but we have it in this much of a palette or this much. I'm like, can I come get it today? She's like, yes. Um, just let me know when you get a count on it and, and like call me back and let me know you want it. And she was just talking and I'm almost running out of service. And I'm like, I want the hay. <laughs> like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, can I give you my card so I can come in and get it? And she just kind of kept rambling. She's like, okay, well, call me back if you want it. And I'm like, okay, because I was like almost out of service. And I'm like... How do I tell her I want the hay? <laughs> she keeps, I keep saying it, and she's like, yeah, well, we'll get the invoice together and send it to you, and if you want to, then you can call us back, and it's just like, I want the hay. <laughs> so I understand that frustration, because sometimes it's like, I just want to do this today, and I don't have all day. I have a lot of stuff to do today, and the last thing I have time for is just like, like, it's when they change the grocery stores around, like, um, Fred Meyer and Safeway and stuff, they always change it around right when you're getting used to it. And then you're like, I just want to come into the stinking grocery store and grab two things. And now it's this search for a treasure hunt to find my groceries. And it takes me about two hours to get the two things that I wanted. When if I could have just run in and grabbed it and got back out again. So I understand the frustration. I don't know. I wasn't really listening. Yeah, I just take my money. I want it. Give it to me. Uh, so I understand his frustration. I know you, we, um, like a certain, if you give them that certain name, like they'll give us a discount, but we're still paying for it because we're owner up. So she's, I don't know what she was saying or that you had to have his name or I don't even know what was going on. I was, and he's just, I'm sure he was just like, just want to pay for it and leave. <laughs> That's all I heard. I was ignoring the rest because, uh, ignorance is bliss. So. So, so far, it is, what, 1 o'clock in the afternoon, and we have done nothing. I washed some sheets, and I put clothes on. Hi, from Maryland. Oh, I don't know what it, what it meant that if you were kicked out. I don't know what that means. If you were kicked out of here? No, I don't, I don't control any of that. I have no idea what I'm even doing. What does this button do? Huh, look at that. Dance. Uh, 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 bubbles. Oh, look at that. I'm swimming around in bubbles. Well, that's cool. Oh, let's dream. Ooh, that's not dreaming. That's hallucinating. Glamour. Am I glamorous looking now? That's cool. Eight millimeter. Oh, I like that one. Hi from the past. Documentary. Why is that a documentary? Sepia silver haunt oh ah uh, i'm reversed sketch that's a scary sketch mm, wow what is going on over here well let's see here i like the old video there that one i'm gonna do that one how do i get out of here i don't know what's going on oh there we go russia hi from russia Zdrasvoji. <laughs> Video from the eighties, like the old, old film ones. <laughs> da. I don't know very much Russian. I was trying to learn Russian, and I gave up. Started learning French instead. Should have stuck with Spanish. But everyone knows Spanish, so I was trying to do something different. But Spanish is really useful. So French is kind of like Spanish, but not really at all. My tenant found the serial number to the boiler so I can get another fan before it breaks off. Do you want to buy a 50-pack? Of? A 50-pack? Do I need a 50-pack? They don't, but I want to sell a single. I just went rounds with him. How much is a 50-pack? Come on in. 
I'm sick of making all these decisions and 75 questions, so I need you to be a part of it. Well, who, we need it, right? Yeah. And there's nowhere else to get all, it. We can spend all the cruising around looking for it, or you can buy a 50 pack. So well, what is it, like $100 million? I don't know. What's a 50 pack cost? That's a fantastic question, Roger. We go grab. I don't have fully threaded in 50 mils, I only have fully threaded in 30 mils and lower. Which was that first one I showed you. Can you bring them both out so I can take a look at them? So getting anything to done today done is impossible. <laughs> It's getting pretty frustrating. Yeah, I can really hear you. Hmm? I hear you. A little stinker? So we need fully threaded, well, right? I think the one they got would work, but I'm just afraid of a back off. I gotta be able to put a nut on it. The kid ain't helping at all. He's been Well, I didn't want to. You, should, you, got, you got to buy a 50 pack? I know. I'm not going to keep a good attitude with that. I don't need right, 50 so bolts, Screws. Here's what I got. Okay. These are a more standard bolt, but they're only half threaded. Yeah, that won't work. These are the original one I brought out here, which are the 30 mil, so they're full threaded the whole length. These guys are, again, that might work. Not full threaded. And you don't have just regular bolts, you just got these Allen head really bobbers. Well, these guys are regular bolts, but I don't have any full threads in regular bolt. Gotcha. Man, that isn't long enough to get threads on there. Yeah. That one won't work for sure. Sounds like a 30 mil guy. I don't even know that that'll work either. Well, maybe that answers the question. I do have longer ones, but they all have that unthreaded yeah, section on Yeah, I need it threaded, because I, I think we're going to be into the threads. Like, there's two pieces that go together, but it, I think this, I don't think that's going to work. It doesn't have the reach. It's got too much unthreaded. Yeah. Is it allowed to just stay hanging there for now? Wrap yeah, but you don't want to get all that shit done in there. No, but can we wrap it in, like, plastic? So that's all the options you got, huh? Yep, that's where we're at right now. I can order something in, but... Who else would carry something like that? Fantastic question. Um, would AIH or is century. that a waste of time? Or? I don't think AIH would have it. You can always try them. I think they'd be a waste of time. I think Century's a lot better bet. They've got to know quite a variety of things. Right. They also will be able to sell you just two. Not a whole pack. Yeah, I just don't need 50 of them. It's yeah. One bolt. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, I get it. We yeah, could, Century Hardware would be we my could, first. We could tap it. Bit. Yeah, you could. Throw a three die. A bit of a pain though. It's a pain in the ass. That is a huge pain in the ass. Is it something that I can just form up my trip and take it over the camera? No, we can do it ourselves. We'll do it. All right, cool. Thank you. No I problem. Hoping, I was trying to pull something off, and that's her money, so I didn't think she wanted to buy 50 as well. Yeah, that's quite a box. Yeah. I want to say it's probably going to be a like rough 30, estimate. 30 I'd have to check the computer. It's not like I'm not spending enough on all this. Stuff. Like 50 to 100. Yeah. All right, cool. Thanks, man. No problem. Uh, what did you say that's that? Can you write oh, yeah. that? This is drop it. that down on Stevie for me. You said 5200 dollars. No. 50 oh. bucks. 5200 dollars Not $5,200. Like, <laughs> no, not near that, that bad. No. It's a M8-125, and you're looking for... I'd say the one you got there is about 50 mils long. Right. So... That's what I'd say. Right on. Yeah, Thanks, That's so what's a metric eight by one point five. And then, I mean, you, would they make a forty mil long? Or no? uh, they probably would, yeah. Okay. I've got them, but again, they have that same threading as this guy, where it has that big long like collar section on it. Right. It's not threaded. And see, the thing it's going into is threaded, so I'm wondering if we could just get rid of the nut completely and not even run on that because it is threaded.
So what's what's it actually running into? It's, it? it's an AC deal. It's it's just AC lines that pinch together, and the bolt goes through the one the bottom line, which has a block on it, and then it threads into the top one that with an O-ring in between them. Maybe it's uh, something we can just temporarily put together so no dirt gets yeah. in it, and then yeah, we'll figure it out. All cool. Right. Thank you. No yes. problem. I mean, I don't know. Have a good day. You as well. Sorry to waste your time. <laughs> that piece of paper? Yes. Ugh. An all thread rod, yeah. All thread rod. All thread rod ain't gonna be a... Well, everybody's got an opinion, don't they? Yep. Yes, but we are brainstorming, too. I know we are. My opinion is slap it you. together get it down the road since I don't need the AC this trip and take the stinking thing into Kenworth. Oh yeah, pay $175 an hour when you can do it yourself. No, it's just that I'm not buying 50 hundred bolts. Well, you could buy three boxes of, or probably a dozen of those boxes of bolts for what you can pay Kenworth to fix. Well, they still have to like do the free on and put it all together though, right? They just gotta charge it. Oh, okay. I thought it was gonna be like handicap parking they should know if it's me and you we deserve the handicap parking I'm sure there's a ton of handicaps rolling in here yeah it's us what did I do with the other end I just dropped it uh oh are you serious I lose everything I think my truck is a black hole I just dropped it on the car the floor is disgusting there's M&M's and... Okay. Alright, let's try this again. Let's keep trying things. Hola. I'm on live. You're on live now. Uh, you don't actually wake up that way. But if you put your feet up... No, he's not. That's why we had our feet on the desk. I'm sure there's somebody there, huh? Somebody. What's... I need shocks for my truck. Okay. Front ones. Because I'm going to bring it in here okay. someday whenever that compressor gets in here. And I just want to make sure. yelled at? So not do it on Monday? Right? Because you were saying. Who was calling me? That was me. It was you. Yeah. yeah. No, well, we can't do it on Monday because we don't have anything to put in it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And I was like, okay, when I got phone she... with her, I was like, I don't think she's coming in with it. Because I know you had that. You said you have your reset coming and you have other repairs and so we were my, about I'm gonna do one more trip and then do the reset. So I have this front two shocks replaced because one's leaking, so I assume you just put both new ones so I'm not like blowing up the other one. Right. And on the steer? Uh, yeah, on the steers. And then we're trying to fix the AC thing right now because the bolt broke. But all the Freon's out, so I'll need, a, like, my AC functioning again. So we're going to try to, like, fix it, but all the Freon's gone. So I need to do that whole nine yards. And then the compressor and the air dryer. And I think 
leak we got and everything else. Okay. And something. then you said there's an oil leak on the back of the high pressure fuel pump? Yes. Let me go check in with Bill really quick and see if he's got that ATV on there. That's why you're here. Yeah, okay. It's not a big deal. I just like, I was hoping that you would have shocks here so that when I brought them in, we could just do it all at once. Yeah. So I'm about to head home though, and it'd be really nice to drop it off. One more trip, then head home. So I was going to replace my airbag, so I got airbags, picked it up from here. I'm going to replace that when I go back over there. And we're going to put the train horns on. He crawls under, he's like, you're leaking here, you're leaking here, your shock's going out, this is broke. And I'm like, make me a list. Aw. Make me a list. Man. Let's see if they have the bolt, he says. Well, well I'm pretty sure that's what Caleb's doing, isn't you it? You have a Pete, though, right? Hmm? You have a Pete? Yeah. Yeah. If that isn't here and I gotta take it to Peterbilt, that's Well, fine. no, I, you, I mean, no, you don't. Okay. You don't at all. I just, I can't look in my Packard system and see if I have your shocks. Oh. Like, normally I could just do that mm -hmm. instead of asking parts to okay. do it, but mm -hmm. if it's a Pete, then I'm not gonna be able to look. Just to make it more fun for your life. It's always something. I made one trip without any issues. Then this Then you're doing better than most people. <laughs> one? One trip? <laughs> I mean... And then my last trip, I had a boot blow off, like, the EGR thing, and I was fixing that on the top of 41 in the wind. That was fun. It took me an hour and 15 minutes, because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Dude. <laughs> and, then, and then I get up to Prudhoe, I'm like, I hear an air leak under my trailer and under my truck. So it was just the triple valve, so I could just torch it and, like, get rid of the one in the back. But the one in the front's an airbag, and I'm like... Oh, my God. Really? Every trip? Every trip? I'm not sure if it's worth... This. Is it worth it? I mean, I don't know. Like, I couldn't do what you do. Track it down. If I need to fly down there to Australia and go get it, right? Bring it back. I mean, tax, right? It'd be tax right off at that point. Because that, because there was not one. <laughs> we write Damn. Yeah, no. <laughs> I'm like, no. <laughs> Lisa was like, are we going to Australia? I'm in the wrong business. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll go down there and get it. And I'll get a write-off. Right. It's a lot of airplane time. Though. Can you help me? Well, Axel. Yeah. I keep thinking like Axel Rose. A-X-E-E-L, right? L-E. No, that's Axel Rose. E-L? I don't fucking know, man. Do you need a Google A-X-E-L? Yeah, that's like, that's A -X -L -E? right. A-X-L-E? AXL is like Axl Rose. I'm oh, it is? Sure. I thought that it's was AXL. AXL. -E. Okay. See, I get them so confused every fucking time. Isn't Axl Rose AXL? Is there an E in it? I don't think so. I don't even know. Can you look up Axl Rose now, please? <laughs> it's AXL. Son of a bitch. <laughs> so if you spell it E L or L E, then we'll, we'll get it. Yeah. Okay. I know, but I just want to spell it right. We'll, we'll get there together. Oh, my God. You can give me the part number. Is it the front or rear shocks? It's the front shocks. Front steer. Apparently, so Axl Rose is not AXEL, it's AXL. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this guy's telling me that it's AXL. Yeah, AXEL. Oh. But it's AXL. Like an, like an axolotl, those uh -huh. little underwater lizard things. Yeah. I have a pin that says, I hate you a lotl, and it's an axolotl. I hate you, lotl? <laughs> it says, I hate you a lotl. <laughs> That's cute. That's funny. Um, what did you guys figure out on the compressor for her truck? Still looking. Still. How many so, times are we going through this? It's a so, parts thing, it's not a service thing, so that's that's why we can't always get you the answer you need because it's we just say we need parts. The no, it's a different one. If there's one there, I'll take it. They I found they found somebody that paid more, so they sold it to them. No, I think that's the wrong one. That's the compressor for industrial. It might be Caleb's compressor. As far as I know with Phil, it's, I know that it's not theirs because I've been dealing with this shit for like a week now. This is, yes. So, so your week's like mine. So what? My horse about tore her eyelid off last night and we were trying to get her to an emergency vet and they're like, we can't see her tonight. I'm like, well, I hope it doesn't did, fall off. Did they keep sending the wrong one? Or? No. So what happened is they ordered it like, they ordered it like four weeks ago and a bunch of parts came in and our new parts guy in the back counter, he got a little flustered. And so he accidentally marked that part as received because he thought we had received it. Well, maybe they're confusing it for that one. Thank you, Jesse. And then I was told that it's somewhere in Tennessee. 
they tracked it and were like, it's somewhere in Tennessee. We didn't actually receive it. But because it showed as received, nobody even bothered checking to see if it was physically here. That's until why I, I called you today and I'm like, it's here. Yeah, until I didn't, so I was looking at the system. I talked to you. And that's when I was like, Chris, where's this compressor? I want to put eyes on it. Mm -hmm. And yeah. We're both having a day. I don't think walking around getting all angry is going to get him anywhere. <laughs> um, ditto. I know, we're working on that. I mean, he's working on that. So, this away. must just be the received paper, right, of the one that supposedly came in but did not. But this is coming <laughs> off the one second. that's on You're so the funny. Give me a second, because this is really fucking frustrating. Like, this is not... I'll be is, patient. This is not a typical thing. So, let me go... It's to, not. Let me go look at the parts. Let me go look It's at just my parts. luck is what it is. I, I carry around this luck that just sucks. Yeah, well, Eli said it was here. So I'm wondering if it... Can you pull it out of a different truck? And... I'm going to go. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. Like, um... <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. That one's going to be down for a while. Yeah, well, yeah that compressor that you had in there. We don't know what happened. Yeah, as it turns out, you get a new one. <laughs> <laughs> I want the new one. Just bring it back both in and then put his back in there and give it a new one. Yeah. Just kidding. I don't want to do that twice. I'm about ready to buy a Kenworth. Are you? Uh, I don't know. I want one, and I, I'm just like, but the new ones are so stupid expensive, and I could literally pay this truck off probably this year or next year. Oh, wow. Yeah. And, but but it's he's like, it. it's falling apart, and it's this and that, and it's like, it's like, this thing's about to give you a lot of trouble. Is it going to be more per year than what you would spend on payments for a new one plus the insurance driving it? Yeah. I mean, I still have warranty on this truck, and I'm still paying this much out of pocket. Oh, yeah. So that's what's crazy about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the... You only get that really good warranty for a year anyways. Oh, really? Yeah. Then you get two-year, and then there's a five-year extended. Yeah. Like, you can keep extending them, but the things that are covered under it start to drop off. Yeah. So, it's yeah, the five-year on it. Yeah. That's why I'm like, is it... You're welcome to take a picture of that. Thought, right? Oh, I won't read it. We'll probably have that somewhere in there. Yeah, you can look it up. Yeah. That's our reference. Yeah, you ready? Yeah, we gotta come back to you. Okay. She's getting me a bolt. Oh, he is? Oh, nice. We're getting a bolt. Uh, I forgot what she left to do, but. That's okay. You guys are coming back. Sorry to interrupt. We're okay. always in a hurry. <laughs> She, Cassandra went back to look for something, but I can't remember what she was. You got some issues to your back of your camera? Well, I don't know. You left it running. We gotta get a bottle of tequila for that guy. <laughs> what guy? That mechanic that helps. Or the that bolt? guy that was talking to you about the stocks. The what? The guy that was out at the front counter talking to you about the stock market. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Yeah, he's cool. I, He's a good dude. I need to get some more stock advice when I get that all figured out. You need to just sit in the pickup and not go in there and get everybody talking so that I can just hurry up and get my day going. I was going in there to make sure their shocks were on order so that when I bring it in, they'll be here. You're not having them put them on, are you? Let's go make some money. 
I'm going to need a nap after my head about exploded here today. Oh, yeah? Well, yeah, now. I have your compressor sitting right next to have the compressor. <laughs> the compressor is sitting right next to that lady's desk. She goes, it won't move till we put it in. So now the truck is going in on Monday. I'm thirsty and I need water. And now I can't find where my credit card is. Oh, I put it in my backpack. Hi, dirty nose. So I guess we'll put the shocks in ourselves. I guess that doesn't look too hard. I just, I was like, I don't feel like asking him to do everything. I don't know how to do it. And so it's just like, I was just gonna get it all done at once, but we can do it, but just like when? It's like, what time now? Yeah. It's a day. It's an okay day. It'll be fine once we get going. I think, you know, I sure wouldn't be heartbroken if I stayed in town and phone service long enough to see pictures of Ember all fixed up. See how M's doing. Mm. Kevin, this is for you. It's not donuts, but it is M&M's. It's not my healthy M&M's. It's the the not very healthy ones. When are you coming up, Billy? Okay, good, Kevin. Mmm. Healthy, yeah. These ones. Those are the healthy ones. Um. So whoever prayed for me, thank you. So, I worked. You can't sleep? Well, moving in July to Alaska? Okay, cool. Make sure we um, at least wave at each other on, by on the road or something. Ask me questions if you have any. You'll be able to up here though. I forgot about that. It's so crazy you just tear that down like it's no thing. No just pull out our guts and lay it out on the table. Yeah. Then you're like, okay, it's back together. This would take me about a week and a half at least to just get this much out. No. Oh yeah, it would. You're underestimating. And it would take about a year and a half to get it back together because I'd be looking for someone to put it together for me. <laughs> I think I screwed up. The compressor. Is my compressor gonna be cool in black too, honey? Oh, oh. can we spray paint it black? I got my whiskey money. They don't have one. That's what I'm doing. Stop. It finally just showed up. This is the third time I told us it's here, though. But it was here. Was it? Yeah, it's sitting next to her desk. Is that Kenzie's desk? No, um, I don't know the lady's name. Smile, you're alive. live. <laughs> oh. Probably shouldn't name names, huh? They don't yeah. know. Oh, I don't even care. Are you ready to do your airbag? What do you want to do? I thought I had whiskey money. Well, it ain't that bad yet, but... It's always that bad. What are we going back to Kenwood for? You get that bolt after he makes it and he's got to tap it because there ain't no So bolts. do the airbag now? Couldn't find a bolt for that thing anywhere. <laughs> Not even in oh, a 50 pack. Special lot. Just got to be long enough so that it's got to basically this, 8 millimeter. Nobody's got one. I told them this part don't matter. I went to fasten all, I went to the Denali fastener, I checked Gunward. On pump water. Not really? Oh, yeah. But uh, they're making them. Yeah. 
Um, do we have time to do the airbag? I'm gonna have to plug this in. Oh, it's not a bad day, it's fine. Um, you, you, we got time to do the Yeah, let's run and do that, we'll get your bolt. That way I put this fucking piece of shit, this thing back together. Wait, so go do that now, or yeah. this now? We're gonna go do that, and then we'll come right back. Okay. And then uh, we'll do your airbag, and we can go over here. should be about that. Do, do, do the airbag when we get back, I guess. I guess we're going to get this. Oh. I'm about to change this on a video for you guys. So you don't get to see it live. Sorry. No, I think it's on the other side, though. It's that one. I don't know why it's not empty. Yeah, that's all. Far from Disneyland. You live in Disneyland, don't you see? Are you Disney? Capped off on here. Oh, and right on. Do you have a Do you have a house bought or rented already? No. Seriously, where was where was the location that it was needed? Well, that's you. <laughs> I get attached to my girls. What can I say? What girls? I'll be back. Which girls? My trucks and you and all of them and Hamster and all your horses. I could reach the door. Um, so this guy on here just said that two hundred thousand dollars for a bolt from the U.S. government because of location and where it was needed. Really? That's an expensive bolt. We have. What to are be... you doing with my glasses on? These are my glasses. Oh. Well, I'm driving. I should be the one seeing. Well, where are those other sweet glasses I have over here? Oh, well, you're fine. Mess that thing up. Don't touch stuff in your pickup. Jeez, Louise. Really? Really? Um. We should probably call this batch. We're going to work. You want to go to work I, or not? You want to go to work or you want to go home? Well, the truck can go in on Monday, so let's just go to work. Right. I need the money to pay for what I'm about to do to the damn thing. I send you a full of good vibes. Thank you, Jesse. Where did it go? The space shuttle, right? Did it go to the space shuttle? What is OJIA? I A A I. Ventura County area? Still waiting on the bank's approval. So you must be buying it. We will be leaving, but it will not be anytime soon. And we're working on both trucks. So. Space transport is included, right? <laughs> right Adrian is in Utah, uh, Utah now, obviously. What a shitty day. Uh uh Yeah, it is. Wash cylinder, that's horrible. Oh, yeah, that is horrible. But does that mean you're still working? Yeah, I'm going to keep running. It ain't, it's score today. Oh, I don't, I don't know what washed means. It sounds clean. Not lubricated, so it scratches the piston. Oh. Just turn it over you did. You got your blinkers on. Yeah, that's a weird bundle. Okay, let's see here. Hello from Colorado. What's it like to drive a truck in Finland? This is all right. Your ID. My family has really enjoyed watching me over the years. Thank you, David. We should get some whiskey. You're buying a new house? Right on, Billy. I need, I'm trying to work on approval too right now. Wait, whiskey for us? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't know how to fix everything. What, you mean driving? I bet, I bet we won't be all in a hurry and stressed out. We'll be like, I can't even see. <laughs> what kind of whiskey does he want? You're coming in, right? Yeah, come on with it. Seat vault, belt law. We went around the block. 
It'll be fine. We're in hick town country. Seatbelt off. They're worried about their seatbelt. Tell them to put it on. Put your seatbelt on, people, if you don't like us driving around with them. Run around the, run around the block. I think we'll like. All right. Let's see what our selection is here. Famous last words. What? See? Onesies. What is the good whiskey to get? Oh my lord. Ooh, I'll tell you what, don't drink Amsterdam. That stuff gives me the worst hangover ever every time my lips touched it. You guys sell this cheap. What is it? The Macagos or whatever it is. Oh, it does it sound familiar? Oh, yeah. You said that was his favorite. Well, Jesse. Awesome. Uh, if I die, I ain't gonna be heartbroken. And it's expensive as shit, too. Oh, okay. So, this, this how is... expensive? Um. Because this is for it, a bolt. Yeah, we're just... <laughs> for what? A, a mechan bolt. A mechanic that's helping us out. I want to know how expensive kind of this bolt's going to cost. I'm pretty sure this is the one that I've been trying to get, and it's over $200. Oh, Holy smokes, that. he's not so a $200 So I'm not bolt. positive, you know, but... Is, where is all your tequila? What is it called? Is this all your tequila? Well, this is a pretty good tequila, and then you go down here. Can you guys look up and see how much the Casa Mingo's tequila like cost? I want to know if it's really $200. That's crazy. I mean, I can suggest ones that are good, better than the price. That shit's expensive. This bucks. one was yummy. We tried it. Yeah. You know? I thought, can we get a little, like, shot? <laughs> Let me look it up online. <laughs> That's great tequila. Adriana, how much is that freaking thing? Okay, this person says a bottle of Casamingos costs $75. That's a really expensive freaking bolt. How is he even hey, thinking wanna, that's you okay? Let's do this one, 33. Well, I mean, screw he's doing me a solid. I know he's doing me a solid, but I don't want to like it's only sixty dollars. Okay, somebody on here told me it was seventy-five. Yeah, so I mean, I looked it up on here, but we just don't. That's have still it. a lot for a bottle. There's one that's called Casamia something something that I'm trying to order for a customer. You know, and it's two hundred something. No, I do want to give him a bottle of something, but uh, if he doesn't, so do you want to do thirty-three? I guess, but is that going to be okay if it's not what he's asking for? Oh, yeah. I mean, I can tell you stuff that tastes good, and you probably like it. What? Oh, this okay. stuff's not good? What tastes... Well, I mean, okay, what tastes I good? Mean, I enjoyed this one, which is Astro? $43. It was actually smooth, and it didn't really taste like tequila. Do you have something a little less expensive um, that's amazing tasting? Because 43 is still a lot. Can we bring it the 30 range? Well, I'll just try the 1800. Yeah. yeah, Merry Christmas. Here you go. This is better than nothing. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we'll take, right? Sure. Can't how's, be horrible. How's this taste? Is it just awful? I mean, it's just something that I had tasted like back, you know, when I was younger. He's a mechanic. He'll favorite. probably he probably drinks motor oil. Me, I like the this lighter colored tequila. Gold is fine. You know, Cuervo Gold is whatever he uses in all the bars. Okay, yeah, this guy says. Oh, that's that one not down bad. there. This one's not bad either. It's silver. What's the Cuervo Gold, go for it. 22. Oh, we'll do that. Uh. We're doing your Cuervo Gold. Thanks for the suggestion. This guy says 1800 is good too, though. You want to do 18? Just make a decision. Cuervo We're spending Gold. enough time here. It's cost Cuervo us Gold. more than your Cuervo buying. Gold. Cuervo Gold. That's, oh my gosh. That's like the cheap junk. It is? Yeah. The guy's going above and beyond the deal. I don't solid. want cheap, cheap junk. The, the Lunacy is good too, but it's 35 bucks. That's, that's fine. Really Lunacy's fine. Too. 35 bucks is fine. What do you think? I just did the. I liked this okay. one too. That one's pretty sweet. Not as much the Repsado as the lighter one. I have a guy that's 80 and he drinks the shit out of that too. So. Well, he's probably immune to it now. So. Make up your mind, grab that what one. you're buying. This one. Is this one good? That one good? I'm getting this one, guys. Right. Fireball. I don't think he wants Fireball. <laughs> the decisions around here. I'm getting away from the bottom shelf. So, you know. But you said it was good. Jose Cuervo? No, this. No, no, that's on second. Three class. fireballs. Oh, I didn't see that. That was, the, the bottom is Jose Cuervo. And you go up. Oh. You got, that was on the second one. And then. Second shelf? Yeah. Okay. And Don't you forget to go cigarette. higher and higher, and then it's better stuff. What did you need? Huh? Uh, you need what? Cigar? No. Oh. It's like Fire, fireballs, fireballs, apparently. Fireballs. Three of them. I'm just reading what someone wrote. Oh. Saying get cigars, too. I'm not getting cigars, too. <laughs> Maybe someday he'll get the other one if he gives me all the And is that all for you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 26 15. 
Right here. Thank you. But I mean, if you don't drink, it's hard. Well, I don't drink tequila. I mean, Thank well, goodness. You know, they, Good they've night. started to bring stuff in where we can try it so we can tell you guys. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, so that's, that's what I was pointing out to Kirk and Jay. Just you kidding. Know? This one likes to just take the whole shot. I'm like, dude, you're going to be mad. I mean, it's like wine tasting, right? Box. Don't swallow the wine. The they, brought, they brought all of every one of the barrels. Do you get to burning. test it while you're at work? Yeah. <laughs> really? Better. Honey, we need a new job. Did you pay for that? Let's go. We'll I paid for it. Let's go. <laughs> Thank you guys. Have a great day. Thank you guys for confusing all my decisions by everyone throwing out their own opinions to the point I can't even make up my mind. <laughs> but I wanted good stuff. Oh, I wanted good stuff. But not too good, you know? Good night! Oh, well, I must have accidentally touched it. You know, I turned, I rolled my window down on my semi to talk to the guard shack guy in 30 below. Couldn't get the stupid thing to go back up. Why? It was barely moving. I had to sit there and hold it going up for like forever now. Alright, a whiskey run for the mechanics. This is fuck this whole day up. <laughs> We've got nothing done, yeah. Hit him, hit him. <laughs> you asshole. Jeez. Oh, what? I mean, it's funny. Well, Why am I the asshole? Don't change for, charge for plastic bags yet? Uh, yeah, they, they used to anyway. Whiskey for my men, beer for my horse, Sun, Sungun. Sun? That's so cute. This is just some days you drive around all day trying to find stuff because nothing works right so that by the time you find it and get to go to do it, the day's gone. And you're like, well, I guess I'm doing it tomorrow instead. Now we gotta change an airbag. Now we gotta change an airbag. They keep telling us to wear our seatbelts. You coming in or you just want me to go handle this? Oh, I would. I wanna, I wanna build some kind of a working relationship with somebody who's gonna get me stock advice. You want this in there? Yeah. Leave my truck on. The bail money. <laughs> this guy says his computer desk is shaking from the sound of the We're talking straight to the back. <laughs> oh, here we go. Why to the back? Thank you. You have no problem. <laughs> Ah, it's, it's not exactly what you wanted because they didn't oh have it. Casamigos gold. Uh, they didn't have it. It's going to be a good so Silver is so now, hard to find. <laughs> it's hard to find, so I got you what I thought. Oh, is that all right? Oh, I don't know. Okay, well, I guess I, she recommended it. We haven't had that one before. She, uh -uh. Said, she said that they give them tester cups uh, that they can uh, test the alcohol in there on the job to see if it's good and give us advice. That's cool. Yeah. Where did you go? Thank you. I appreciate it. That's oh. kind of you guys. Thank you. Oh, it's good of you guys. They definitely have to do this, but yeah, that should yeah, work. work. Yeah. Um, we have most of the down, but we it up. Yeah. <laughs> polished it so it shouldn't hang up on you at all. Okay. There's one spot that's a little thin. All right. It's, it's kind of hard to do. It's not threaded. Thank you so like, much. More or less, I just need to make sure that I don't get down to where it doesn't thread. So yeah. this, this should work fine. Thread it all the way to the end, so you should be good to go. Yeah, no, I'll be good, dude. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Problem. See you later. See you guys. 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 So you guys still got the compressor? What? Yes, it's right there. Look, uh, it's, I brought it's it up here. Can I have It'll proof? Be here. I It'll picked it up and I brought right it up there. here. There's proof. There's my air compressor. I'll so, bring it Monday. Sounds yeah. good. We'll get It'll be here Monday. Yeah, okay. I said it's It'll not going anywhere until they go to put it in the truck. Can you put a chain and lock on it? I was thinking about trying it I know. Yeah. <laughs> in the briefcase you guys the open that box and you make sure there's a compressor in there we've thought about it okay, okay. <laughs> it's pretty fucking heavy so sure so good at the funny part <laughs> is that they couldn't get any of those right we know the whole store and tuesday we got three seriously well because we bought another one for another customer too and we weren't sure if that one was going to show up so we ordered two for them now you go we got there the gave it to them got an extra one in the back now and that i thought you were guys were going to do the same thing from. This came in on Tuesday while I was on vacation, and Chris had told me that there were none available. He Sally swiped it no. from Sally. the counter and didn't let anybody know and put it back there, so nobody knew it was here. Where's he at? 
He's on. He's not here. Tell us where the damn microphone Where'd he go? He went to Anchorage. So his wife's a school teacher. So he wants the same days off that people with kids do. So so he's taking the last two days of spring break, and they're going to Anchorage. Nice. That's not a good vacation. Yeah, we're taking Monday off. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Oh, you know, you left I don't me. know. Left me this phone. So just in case, case you want to. Yeah, you guys are going yeah. somewhere. <laughs> we're leaving. Come oh, on, shit. you're done talking. <laughs> See you later. Man. Thank you. That's how we get a bolt. Huh? I said, and that's how we get a bolt. That's the way you get bolts, no people that in right, Alaska. That right there, that shit makes people. Yeah, that, that's how you do it, I guess, in the trucking world. So you're learning a lot by watching my videos. You, you take care of the people that take care of you. Yeah, for sure. That's why I got to take care of this one. Especially in Alaska, because they're very yeah. limited on good people to help you. Yeah, if we have like, GW's like, can you find me a shop to take my truck to? I'm like, uh, you only have like two choices, so. It shouldn't be hard. It shouldn't be hard to find it. So you just got to take care of them. I'm learning a lot from you, Lisa. <laughs> this, this is a day of trucking. We've done nothing. This is probably overkill, but it's just kind of one of them things. It was a, it was a forty dollar a bolt, or was it thirty? Thirty forty dollar bolt plus three friggin' fireballs. Oh, calm down. The fireballs are for the taxi driver. <laughs> Not the fireball whiskey. Not the fireball whiskey. The actual fireballs. She didn't let me have no fun, folks. Oh, I, you can have fun all he wants as long as it gets put on, right? Maybe if he had a little, he'd calm down a little. Oh, Maybe I have been drinking. Yeah, the way Where's your seatbelt? Driving like that? Jeez Louise! I do not look like Avril Lavigne. I only wish I looked like Avril Lavigne. Why are you so cute? Uh-huh. Um, um, my, my parents. My parents? My parents were two good-looking people, and they just made a good-looking baby. How am I doing, Lisa? I'm just spectacular, Mar. Get the, we're getting that airbag changed. We're doing the airbag next, so I have to say toodaloo to y'all because I'm making a... Ooh, I should have had this thing clipped in charging instead of killing the battery the whole thing. All right, guys, I got to go because I'm going to use this to make a video of changing the airbag so you guys can watch that later. What's wrong with my truck? Airbag. Airbag. And everything else that falls off of it. Everything's wrong with it. Busy day, yes. Get out. Gotta go, guys. Bye!